Agua, get down from the tree. I don't want to. You know that Mama asked me to watch you today. I know. I'll stay here and you watch me from over there. Oh, kids. My perfumed plum blossom, I would do anything for you. Get you any gift, even the moon. If I could, the moon. Uh oh. Plum sauce. Sir Richard? Madam? Honorable Magistrate? Oh, ah, <laughs> sorry for dropping in unannounced. Shigua, where are you? Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Now that's what I call a good landing. And there I was, face to face with an ancient fossil and no way of getting it home. Prehistoric fossils? Near here? Yes, by George. On top of Lotus Mountain. I'm returning for them in the morning. How exciting. If there is anything I can do, Sir Richard, the only thing would be to join me in a toast. Don't! Oh, 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 oh. My balloon is almost ready. I wish I could go flying in one of those. Me too. How about you, Shigua? Wouldn't you love to... Shigua? Oh, great. And I promised Mama I'd watch her again. And then I untie the ropes. <laughs> Except for the main one. <laughs> Whoa! Shigua! Sogwa, I'm stuck! We have to hurry. The balloon's going to take off. Now, I just undo this last rope. Oh, dear. No! no. Oh, oh, no! We're floating away! No! Sogwa and Shigwa, they're in there. We've got to go help them. I'm not going near that thing. What can we do? I don't know, but I can't let that thing out of my sight. Come on! Oh! Close. Oh. Sogwa? My lucky cat friend? I don't know how you cats got in here, but I'll drop you right back home. As soon as I pick up my fossil on that mountain. Hmm. Uh, they're getting further away. Hey, this will speed things up. Now, if the mountain is here, and, and we're here, and north is here, then, then we're <laughs> going the wrong direction. I can't believe I let this happen. This is all my fault. Not to worry, my feline friends. Going up should help us change direction and escape this dreadful wind. I'll just empty this bag of sand. <laughs> oh, oh, that's not good. I'm scared. Hey, it's just a ride in the sky. You always tell Fufu you wish you could fly, right? Yeah. Well, we're flying. Don't worry. We'll be okay. Here goes. Time to lose a little weight. Wow! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Uh, 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 whoa! Yeah. If things weren't such a mess, <laughs> this would actually be fun. Oh no! 
Now the balloon's going the other direction. Come on! You should see this magnificent view! There! There's Lotus Mountain! We'll have to alter our course slightly. In a cloud. I can't see a thing. Oh, by George, this is a mess. No shrimps until you finish your writing, Shigwa. That's Baba. Do another. I knew you'd like this game. Okay, who's this? Hi, guys. Good to see you. Ow! Whoa! <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> Good one. That's Fufu. Hmm? Uh-oh. What's that? I'm not sure. Oh, no! Stop, puncture! If we could anchor the balloon, I'm sure I could patch it. <coughs> what to do? What to do? <coughs> the rope? The pickaxe? Yes! Good work, my lucky cat! Not just one, but two lucky cats! If I work fast to patch the balloon, we'll still be able to float to the top and retrieve that fossil. By George, there's no time to lose! What's taking you so long? I didn't fly up. Where are we? We're on a mountain. I know that, but which mountain? Hmm. This mountain. Are we lost? Just because we don't know where we are doesn't mean we're lost. Eh. Yeah, okay, we're lost. I'm really angry at myself for breaking my promise to Mama. I should have kept you safe. But you didn't break your promise. You got in the basket because you were looking after me. And you're still looking after me. Yeah, I guess. Besides, I never should have climbed on the balloon. You're right about that. Listen, you better get down. It might be dangerous up here now. But I don't... Hmm. Okay, I'm listening. <laughs> I'm so sorry, little kittens. I failed. <laughs> I don't believe it! You're not just a lucky cat, but an ingenious one, too! Oh, no! At least we only missed by one mountain. I wish I could fly. By George! Make room for the fossil, my little cat friends! Wow. I've never seen anything this old. This is the best day of my life. 
Look on the bright side. The balloon's almost back at the village. Yeah, that is good. But they got the ride of their lives, and I'm still stuck walking all the way home. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe not all the way home. Hi, George. There's the village, and there's the palace. You lucky cats will be home in no time. Thanks for looking after me, Sogwa. I would have been really scared if you weren't here. What are big sisters for, right? Right. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, I'm flying! I'm really flying! <laughs> and I'm sweating. Really sweating. It's almost the seventh day of the seventh month, which can only mean one thing. And in honor of tomorrow's Ching Ren Jia Festival, the magistrate wishes to invite everyone, young and old, to celebrate all the emotions of the heart. All the emotions of the heart. Oh, I love this festival. Hey, Sagwa. What do you say we go down by the wharf and see how the decorations look? Can't. I've got plans with Dongwa. He promised to take me to a new peddler who gives cats fish treats. Fish treats, huh? Meow! <laughs> what do you think? I think you better hope the peddler <laughs> likes bats, too. He said he'd be here. Maybe we were supposed to meet him at the fish stalls. Maybe. Do you see him? When I do find him, he better have a really good excuse. Cook! Hey, Cook! I wonder what he's up to. Why? You were supposed to meet me, to show me that new fish peddler. Oh, yeah! I waited all morning. Sorry. Uh, tell you what, tomorrow I'll take you to a new cave I found in one of the mountains. You mean it? Really? Count on it. I'll meet you in the back alley right after my Tai Chi. Wonder what he's up to. Um, your magistrate? Uh huh? Have you noticed Cook acting peculiar lately? Uh huh. He normally uses the brown tea set, and this is the black tea set. That isn't what I meant. Oh? Last night, I heard him singing, and there were odd banging noises coming from his quarters. Really? <clears throat> I can't believe Dongwa forgot about me again. Maybe that's because he's hanging out with Hun Hun. They've been together every day this week. What? But he was supposed to be doing things with me. I'm just telling you what I see. Come on, I'll show you. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> this is a blast, hun hun. There's no one else I'd rather play with. <sighs> Cook has been acting strangely, don't you think? Reader says there are strange noises coming from Cook's quarters at night, and he was singing. Really? Singing? The Qingren Jia Festival? <gasps> he must be in love! Shh! Do you think? 
There can be no other explanation. What is it, Your Magistrate? Hmm. <laughs> nice move. Where'd you learn that one? My Gung Fu master taught me. Hey, can you teach me that hind leg kick thing? Sure. Yeah. I am so mad at him. So they like hanging out together. What's the big deal? The big deal is... Uh, Han Han is... Is what? Look, Jet Jet, I, I didn't want to say anything before, but... Uh, oh, but Han Han's not very nice. What are you talking about? She's the nicest cat in the alley. Really? Oh, well, I saw her, um... Uh, I saw her take a whole pile of shrimp from those baby <gasps> kittens in town. Han Han? No way! I saw it happen. Really? Stealing food from kittens? That's awful! Told ya. Stealing shrimp from babies? Sagwa. I only said it because I was mad at Dongwa. I just hope it doesn't come back to bite you. It won't. I hope. Hey, did you hear about Hun Hun? She's taking food out of little kids' mouths. <gasps> I know. Despicable. I can't even talk about it. Positive, he's making himself a new robe for the festival. Maybe if I could get up a little higher. Here, get on my shoulders. But your magistrate... I insist. Oh. Looking for you know who. Okay, thanks. Oh, uh, does he know about Hunt? I mean, you know who? Uh, I didn't have the heart to tell him. Your one small rumor is running wild. I know, and I have to find a way to stop it. There he is. <laughs> Talk to you. Not now. I have to do something. But it's about Hun Hun. I already know Sagwa. Thanks anyway. <clears throat> yes, Your Magistrate? I, that is, we, were uh, wondering if you um, <laughs> needed to leave early so you can take your. Mystery Woman to the Chinrenjia festivities tonight. Mystery Woman? Hmm. Of course. I'm sure she will love the flowers. Please forgive me, but I do not know what you're talking about. It's all right. We know all about it. 
With all due respect, I am not sure you do, but you will tonight. Uh -huh. Huh? All the emotions of the heart. There you are. What's wrong? I can't believe you did that. Not you two. Everybody's acting so weird. What exactly did I do? Nothing. Sogwa, this is between me and Hun Hun. No, it's not. It's my fault. I started the rumor. What? A rumor? What rumor? I said you weren't very nice. And you took shrimp from the village <gasps> kittens. I'm sorry, Hun Hun. But why would you do that? And why would you believe such a thing? I was mad at him. He was supposed to be doing stuff with me, not you. And I didn't even stop to think about whether it was true or not. I feel just awful, Hun Hun. Well, what you both did is not okay. Believing a ridiculous rumor is almost as bad as spreading one. Almost. Hey, Hun Hun, we can help stop the rumor from spreading. I'll tell everyone that I made it all up. Sure, that will help. And then I think Sogwa and I have some plans together. You mean it? Really? Really. I made this for the children, for the festival. And now you know I like to sing while I work. I feel just so silly that we rush to so many conclusions. Next time, please feel free to ask me anything before making up everything. Oh. I never meant to ignore you. It wasn't right. Yeah. But you know, I do have my own friends. I can't do everything with you. I don't want to do everything with you. <laughs> Just the fun stuff.